Learning in a 21st century environment, a local university has a new state-of-the-art engineering department for students. Eyewitness News reporter Cody Butler takes us inside. A crowd of more than 100 people came out to Wilkes University Friday to dedicate the new Mark Engineering Center inside the Stark Learning Center. I went away for the summer and I came back and I was just totally impressed with uh, how modern, <laughs> you know, this, uh, this new wing of Stark looks. Associate uh, Professor of Mechanical Engineering Ed Bednars says the newly renovated section has three new facilities, which include a bioengineering, nanotechnology, and 3D printing with new labs creating a true state-of-the-art facility for current and future students. Our goal is to get our students relevant jobs in their field uh, when, when they graduate, so we want them to have their hands right in current technologies. It's an $8 million investment in STEM education with a 23,000 square foot overhaul renovation. Randy and Robin Mark gave a leadership gift supporting the project. Randy has served on the university's board of trustees since 2013. We have the opportunity uh, to help inspire innovation and hopefully encourage success among the students. Wilkes University's president, Patrick Leahy, says the country has seen a gap in engineering graduates, which he says has hurt the industry as a whole. We as a nation need to educate more engineers uh, in order to remain competitive worldwide. The new renovations are a step in the right direction here in Luzerne County. In Wilkesbury, Cody Butler, Eyewitness News. That project took 16 months to finish and it was finalized in August. The construction was completed in many phases to avoid disrupting classes during the school year.